Dear Ahavad Achim family, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Barry Herman and I'm the Executive Director here at uh, the AA Synagogue. I wanted to take this opportunity and this particular message to talk about the unsung heroes who work behind the scenes here at the AA to make things run flawlessly and smoothly for you. At this stage, I'm sure that you've met our directors, Jackie Nix, Sharon Gratz, Miriam Habeff, Galfond, God that I need to add that now, um, as well as our intrepid uh, marketing guru, Lauren Doobie, but, and of course, Chris Carr, our facilities director. I wanted to focus, as I said, more about the people who work behind the scenes. So let's start off with our facilities crew, uh, long time serving members of our facilities crew, Ken Johnson, Wesley Coney, and Deontay Huff, uh, who make things happen in the building for making sure that the building is well maintained, uh, making sure that uh, all the events in the synagogue happen smoothly uh, and they happen well, and they do this service to our congregation with a great amount of love. Uh, moving on into the office, there's Catherine Ficke, who is our office manager. In addition to her duties uh, in the office, she makes sure that all the mailings go out. She does all of our banking. She distributes all of the mail. And amongst other things, uh, deals with tributes um, and anything related to cemetery. Moving along to Fern Shaw, you all know as our receptionist, she's the first person that you speak to when you call in. Uh, but what you don't know is that she also follows up on behalf of our rabbis um, anybody who has pastoral needs or anything going on in the community, she's on the phone a lot, gathering that information so that we don't leave anybody out. She also does tributes, um, and as I mentioned, she also answers the phone, she makes sure mailing square out. It's a small office, we all have to multitask and do a number of different things. Stan Vogel, our finance manager, who's been here for more than 20 years, Stan treats the money at the synagogue better than his own money. Um, and takes great care and personal love for our congregation in discharging his duties. He helps him with cash flow and making sure that uh, all our bills go out on time, um, uh, as well as paying all of our bills, making sure our, all of our vendors are taken, uh, are taken care of. Um, and of course, our congregation and our membership, it's a mammoth task and he does it with great skill and he does it with great love. And then lastly, Jill Rosner, who coordinates everything on behalf of our rabbis. Uh, in addition to maintaining their calendar, she handles anything related to ritual, uh, anything related to services. Um, and she's the first contact point many times for our congregation for both sinkers, as well as unfortunately for bereavements and things are, uh, that are not going all that well. So uh, again, I wanted to take this opportunity, we're coming into the holiday of Shavuot, to wish you all a Chag Sameach, it's Man Matan Torah Tenu, the time of giving our Torah, great celebration. Um, and it begins the countdown, ironically, for the High Holy Days. In my next uh, video, my next message, um, I'll talk a little bit about the year in review, um, how we've done financially, what's happening with our sanctuary construction, um, and thank everybody more appropriately. I look forward to doing that because we've got a good story to tell. So again, Chag Sameach and Shabbat Shalom, and we'll speak again sometime next month.